Hey, what's up guys? Team Hard Life Captain Albert Zertucci here. All right, so for today's video is a little device that we have wanted in our inventory, but it really hadn't had a chance to get it in. And what it is, is a portable air compressor. That is the biggest thing because for us, going down beach means that at any given time you can have a flat tire or you have to make your tires run low so that way you can get better grip and traction. Traveling down beach can have tons and tons of obstacles to maneuver through or around and so forth. Sand is the biggest one and having proper air inflation or deflation of your tires is very critical at a lot of points. So having a portable air compressor is a huge benefit for us because in my truck I don't have a built-in air system. You know I know some of the newer bigger trucks do. So this will give me the opportunity to be able to still play with the big boys and deflating my tires and inflating them with a safe measure that I will always have the proper air in my tires because even when deflated when I hit the hard road I gotta inflate them again so what I'm planning on doing is testing out the battery um, for one two is to see how long it would take for me to inflate all four of my tires from a zero or from a flat position let me put it that way so I've got all four of my tires on my Tundra that we are gonna flat for this video Ah, it, it hurt me already, you know, I don't want, who likes seeing flat tires? Nobody, but I'm going to do it for y'all, because I love y'all, so let's go and get it done. So I'm going to do a little test of my battery, it's full of energy, and it's a 60 volt, flex volt, yep, it's a 6 amp hour, and so we're going to go ahead and get it on, and I'm going to go ahead and start charging up my compressor while I deflate my tires. Oh, I'm telling you, it's hitting me right here. I gotta deflate my truck for this one.
tell you what, man. Flatten tires ain't fun. Alright guys, so I've already finished deflating my tires and it's such a horrible feeling to know that my truck is flat right now, but uh, you know, sometimes you gotta do something to prove a point or to find out what it can actually do, you know, you gotta put everything to the test. So let's go ahead and start filling up. It's sitting in there and it's 2.5 DeWalt air compressor, so let's see what it can do. freight coupling that I had purchased for this test is actually just sheared apart as I added air to it so I'm trying to get it to work but I may have to go to the secondary one that came with the package yeah the whole quick link assembly had disassembled and the beads fell out of it and everything so I'm gonna go inside and get the adapter second adapter I have that came with the unit and see if we can get this to go through because now I'm hemorrhaging air out of there.
well, the battery made it. <laughs> I filled up one one tire, but the device broke on me, so it leaked out, and it was eating it up. So uh, I'm gonna get the other battery and get this going. I need to get home. All right, so here's the second battery fully charged. compressor is that it once it tops off at 135 psi I go ahead and start filling up my tires however once it drops down to about 30 psi I go ahead and stop using the air pressure let the charger get the air tank filled back up to 135 and then I reapply it what ends up happening is I've discovered that it takes three tanks to get up to 50 pounds of pressure in order for me to get the uh, pressure I need for each tire so All right, so I've got all four tires aired up. It took two batteries to do it. That one still has charge, so I can do probably a fifth tire from a totally flat position. But I think it had a lot to do with that the couplings actually busted on me. So I may have to do this test again, but it still gives me a pretty good idea of what I'm working with for the batteries and this compressor, which in a pinch to get one or all four tires aired up, it can be done. Just make sure to have two batteries with you and that's pretty awesome because now I can carry this in the truck behind the seat with no worries which is great because now this is something more that we can take down beach if I need an emergency tear up. All right. 